are of all those people who like creepy stuff. Top five. Today we are going to be doing top five horror movies that are based on true stories in real life. Okay. Number one. Chucky. There was this little boy who wanted a doll so desperately. The one that the thing that really caught his eyes that had blonde hair. The little boy had blonde hair too. He got it one day. He played with it all day, nonstop, all night. He went to go to bed. So he put the doll right over by side him on a table. He heard a big thunk. The doll was gone. So he goes out to look. He trips on the doll. And he says, shh, it won't hurt. Stay still. I just need to become human. I need your soul to help. He took the little boy's. He almost took the little boy's soul. But he ran. And he took an axe and chopped off the doll's head. Red stuff came all out of it. Number two. Lights. So, Lights Out was based on a little girl who was put in a medical hospital because every time she was in the sun, her skin would peel. And one day, there was a girl who was put in the hospital because she was insane. And then, they became best friends, not because they wanted to be. Because she, because Emily, the one that had the skin condition, forced her to be her friend. And then the doctors called her because they tried to help with the skin condition. Tied her down to a bed. Put light on her. Burned her skin all off and killed her. Then one day, they said that Jesus brought her back to life. Sophie, that was actually her name, was doing fine watching a movie with her son. She saw Diana. I'm just joking. She saw Emily. Emily said, leave the lights off. She turned them on. Emily was gone. She turned them off. All she, all they saw was Emily's shadow staring at them. He turned on the light and Emily burned. But it didn't hurt her. I mean, it did, but her skin started to burn of her long nails. The m Sophie shot herself in the heart and it only gave Emily one choice but to kill herself like in like in the real movie lights out she shoots herself and then Diana dies number three Freddy Krueger It was about this boy that was called Butterfly Boy. Cause he was really thin. And he had something wrong with him. That he used to itch a lot and it used to scab and then bruise and bruise. And and his skin would fall off. <coughs> and his skin would fall off. One day, some kids made the fun of him. So that one day, he wrapped tape all around, broke a knife and stuck the pointy parts on his finger. Wrapped some tissue paper around his hand so it looked like a glove. They had dreams about him when he was doing this. They would wake up and he would 
scratch him all over and say, why did you pick on me? It was not funny. And in their dreams, they would imagine him cutting them and they would die because how scared. Number four, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary is based on a girl that was a farm girl and had a party in her barn. She said, oh, let me go down and get more party snacks. She tripped and something fell through her eye and killed her. The young girl's name was Mary and blood was all over her face. Some dry and everything. And she had long hair covering her face. Then one time, she had a flashback of, of when girls picked on her. She was not dead. She came back to life because there was no reason for her to die. And then they used to pick on her and say, oh, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Oh, in the mirror. She was right behind them in the mirror. Scream and kill them. Girls used to go down into cellars and play it. And then she used to chase them. And then one day a girl went crazy because she swore that she saw her in the mirror and chopped off her friend's head. Like in the real movie, she chops off her friend's head. Finally, the fifth, fifty fifth, fifth, fifth one. Do you know what it could be? Hmm. Okay. Jeff, the killer. It's based on this boy that was picked on a lot. And he used to get cuts a lot. So one day these boys made fun of him and he cut himself like this and said, is it worth it to make fun of me now? And it made it look like he had a big bloody smile. And he went scissors and chopped off his eyelids. Just then one time his friends were asleep and he snuck into their house and he stabbed them in the stomach 10 times and said, why did you pick on me? And kept on stabbing them. And then when they were dead, he carved a smile into their face. Thank you guys for watching. Which one do you think was the scariest? Leave it down in the comments. Bye.